My favorite pastime is playing golf. I think that it's one of the most beautiful games that you could ever play. I've been playing since the age of four. My dad was a professional, my aunt was a professional. They grew up playing it and I grew up playing it and there was no question, I mean, they never had to force me to play. It's just something so easy that I fell in love with. My name is Sofia Pulen. I am from Matamoros, Mexico, but also Brownsville, Texas. And I am a data engineer and strategist for the chief data office at AT&T. Growing up in Brownsville, Texas was one of the best experiences of my life, I think, because I was able to be Mexican and American at the same time. So I've always gone to school in the US, but I would go to school and then I would go to Mexico within the next five to 10 minutes and go to golf practice and then drive back to Brownsville to do my homework and go to sleep and rinse and repeat. So it was awesome being able to live with that type of culture, the border culture. I have two undergraduate degrees at SMU that are STEM focused and then my master's from SMU in engineering management. My SMU experience was something that I never imagined it would be. The second that I stepped foot on this campus, I fell absolutely in love. There was no question on where I was going. And it wasn't only the beauty of this campus, but it's the sizes of the classes. I knew everyone in my class of electrical engineers. I was able to make all these connections with my professors. I was involved in research. I was a TA for robotics. And I feel like SMU was able to give me those opportunities and especially dive into the things that I really wanted to learn more about. The AT&T Technology Development Program is a two-year rotational program where recent college engineering graduates are able to take roles on like data analysts, systems engineer, network engineers, software developers, and technical business managers. So they're able to rotate jobs all over AT&T, which is absolutely incredible because there aren't many places where you can gain an experience within two years. So you'll have many jobs within those two years and, and learn a lot in a short amount of time. So I, I think that the culture in the technology development program is really strong, and especially as someone who's just recently graduating from college, it's a pretty easy transition. I just changed jobs two weeks ago. So I will say as of now, I am starting to code again slightly, but mostly from a perspective of a strategist. So if we want to implement a new technology that maybe our data engineers or data scientists might use in the future, at least with like Gen AI, what does Gen AI look for us five to 10 years from now? Well, we have to start looking into that now so that we can you know, be ahead of the curve. What I do is I'll look at the code or I'll try to run some prototypes on my computer to see if it's something that we can run with or something that we can start preparing our engineers for. The Chief Data Office has some of the smartest people I've ever met in my entire life. They're always thinking about the people that we serve, and I think that's what makes the technology important. As a data engineer and a data strategist, we look at all of this information to make your life better. So what are we doing five to 10 years from now so that we're ahead of the curve as a company, so that we can make the right decision, so that we could support our employees, but also support the customers that we you know, provide this awesome service to. I absolutely love my job. I say the most important thing is to find what you love. You can find what you love wherever you go. So you can change jobs, you can change cities, you can change your decision on what you're majoring in. But wherever you are, find what you're passionate about, and I think that that's what makes life worth it. <laughs>